I need to speak with Douglas. I call. You need to see who is going to win Montreal. No. Mr. Grant's business is prosperous and growing, and the Brown Brothers is in decline. So, Michael, be pragmatic. Montreal is the future. And whoever takes Montreal will take control of the entire fur trade. And the Hudson Bay Company will continue to falter. Let me ask you something. Please do. Why'd you drag her out here with you? She's become very precious to me. We've revealed quite a lot to each other, haven't we? And you know, one thing she did reveal to me was um, about all the years you spent in poverty living on the streets of London. You wouldn't want to go back there again, would you? <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's one good thing about living like a thief. And what's that? You learn to tell when a situation is fucked. And I can tell that there's something fucked about this situation. Let's put a little honesty in this conversation, though. Those pelts that you're trying to sell are stolen. The HPC has every capable scout on your tail and you cannot outrun them. Now you need a buyer. I miraculously have a chest of silver here. I know this conversation has been wonderful. I think it's time we bring it to an end. And you make a choice, one way or the other. Michael. What are you doing? Elizabeth Crothers is dead. We need a buyer. Where is Harp? He's not here right now. I'm here in his stead. Where is he? I don't know. 